Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Make sure that you go and uh, subscribe on my YouTube channel if you do not subscribe. Okay guys, here we do have a website. Our website is www.forexstreamchaser. Uh, make sure, make sure that you go and check this website. You will get almost because because it is available for as little as um, 200, 200 rand right now. Um, 200 rand and make sure what they call this thing, e coupon. When share a coupon, you just go and use this link or we type in the Italian description. I'm going to check that one because of the land. Okay, guys, today I want us to check or to avoid taking unnecessary losses. Things that you can do to avoid unnecessary losses. Number one, you must also check which pattern are you using in the market? Which strategy are you using in the market? You can see here I'm using one hour time frame. As I am using one hour time frame, it will depend which, which pattern am I using. You know that I only use four patterns in the market. Let's say, for instance, I'm using a potential continuation pattern. What is it that I'm going to do right now? Right now, I'm going to zoom in to check what is it that we have. Do I have a potential continuation pattern here? No. Do I have one here? No, but I do have a big one. This one is very much big for us to take, but I do have one here. So what is it that I'm going to do? Check here. Okay, fine. This is what we support. This support check is in a matches all right. That one is very much important. You see here, all this support check is in a matches a money. What is it that you're going to do? You look for a possible entry while the market is going down rather than buying here. Remember, now we are avoiding AMA losses that are unnecessary. How do you do that? If you know that you trade a potential continuation present, make sure that whenever Uvula is in circle and there's no opportunity, Make sure that you don't take that trade. Uma uzo vula e trade. Make sure uguti e trade lack of the safe to take it. Guys, I'm gonna repeat this. Uma of number profitable in the market. Don't create opportunities that are not there. In the market, for you to be profitable, you wait for the right opportunities. Sometimes you'll hear people saying, oh, they're the best, they create opportunities that are not there. I will show you why so many people are taking unnecessary losses. Imagine someone gonna look at uh, this two candlestick and then you decide that no, the market is going down, the market is going down. You decide to sell here, the market here is in the direction. By the time you go over, here pays you. Here, actually, let's say you're gonna approximately here, you place your stop loss here, then the market is in the direction. By the time you shy, you pays you. You know what, flip. I was, I was wrong to sell you it's a buy man. Flip, what was I thinking? You start buying here. The market came back down. You shy, you shy double. Are you going to continue? You, you, you be like, as in, flip, being shy here. So now what is it that I have to do? I have to sell here so that the, the market will reach my new support. You start selling here, the market reverses again. What were you selling specific here? Nothing. What you did, you were looking at the size of the candlestick and then you decided to take a decision, of which is one of the things that will cost you, it, it will cost you a lot. The best thing that you can do in the market, wait for the right opportunity. If you cannot wait for the right opportunity, then you won't be profitable. Believe me, you will say so. Once you learn that in the market, you wait for the right opportunity, the higher the chance that you're gonna be profitable. It takes hours for the market to get to certain levels. Let me make a perfect example so that you can understand what I am talking about. When I'm operating our seven side in the market, out for one key afuna which open a snake. Unga bilo munt otata it decision right now. I can see it's a sell. It's a sell. I'm gonna sell here. Look at this. How do we confirm that we have a trend line? We need to have the first time touch and the second time touch of which is here now. Check when was the second time charge. Means taking around uh, nine, 29, around seven o'clock. The market be tested what time in trend line. When was the right time for you to sell? 1 a.m. the following day, 1 a.m. 
What were you doing in the meantime? Nothing. You were perfectly waiting for the market to reach this trend line so that you can sell here. But uh, if you fail to wait for the market to come and touch the trend line, you yeah, here. You, you had my challenges here. Believe me when I say so. This is the right place where you're supposed to sell. Imagine decide with the higher thing, it is going up. This is where it's supposed to buy. You start buying here, you change your direction. You start selling, expecting, expecting the market to come down. It goes up. What do you do from there? You don't do anything, you run away from this pain. You're like, you know what? Ah, here they are scheming me, they are scheming. And no one is scheming you, just that you're doing things that you don't know. As check it out, it turned like it to correspond a line here. Unfortunately, if I use this touch, it doesn't, it doesn't correspond. Let me use this one, it will make sense. Well, this is accurate. Let's say you're using trend lines only in the market. Nothing other than trend lines, where you're gonna be able to get this uh, entry. The answer is yes. But then again, as much as the answer is yes, what is common here? With uh, flip. Okay, it's fine, but this is perfect. Here, you have your first time. You have your second time here. Where do you have to sell? As soon as the market is we to this trend line, the right place for you to sell, your stop loss is above. How many hours were you waiting for the trend line? Now, Ubula, Uchat Lako, Uchola, the market, Yaman. They had decided, ah, flip, I can see. I can see that the market is going up. I'm going to get in and buy here. I'm going to get, I'm sorry, the market is going down. I'm going to get in and sell. As soon as you sell, you sell a lot. You might be lucky the market will go down. But it's not always where you're going to be lucky. That is why we have so many people who are blowing their account. They keep on trying their lucky. Imagine getting in here and then you become lucky. The market went up with you. You start uh, being excited. You're like, no, I, now I can kill the market. You get in here expecting to do the same thing then. Start uh, buying here, expecting that the market is going up. If we are planning to start selling, expecting that the market is going down, you understand that the challenge is that you're going to face if you don't know what you are doing in the market. So the best thing that you can do in the market, make sure that you do something that you know. If you don't know, don't bother yourself to create things that you don't know. So you're going to have challenges. The account is ease of doing. Man kumbula gase, lente lena ikona wikosyan. Now my video and when we were supplying demand. I always say in the beginning of a new trend, that's where you're gonna get your supply and demand. Here is your supply and demand. The market went down. If you see this green candlestick, it went up to test what is supply and demand. And look at what happened. There's a right place to sell, there's a right place to buy. If you want to understand that, therefore you'll have challenges. This is the right place where you're supposed to sell. Look at how the market went down. Look at uh, how the market came back down here. And then look at the difference. You can tell that you have so many people who are selling here. But then it is not safe to jump in and sell here. You might be lucky by doing that, but you're not going to be lucky full time. You wait for the right opportunity. If uh, you get in here and sell, you place your stop loss above. Let the market go down. You're going to use your left hand side to place your take profits. That's it. Now, we lost, we avoid a range of if let's say uh, specifically you uh, are trading trend lines, are we told the trend line? Or specifically, I have I'm a student attend the trend line. The reason why they love trend lines, most of them are zero floats. You can make a lot of money with trend lines. But then, as much as you're going to make a lot of money, if it happens that you're going to take a loss, you will find yourself losing less, which is what I love about trend lines. Sure. Now, looking at what we have here, in the beginning of a new trend, that's where you're going to get a supply and demand. So, Uma also found the legume. I'm a person as well as when the side of China like I am like it, I'll fall. Uma, I'll fall. So, seven years are in the first one. It's going to be, uh, let's say, support, support, and resistance. Sharp. Let's move with the second one. The second one was over in supply and demand. The third one is going to be E trend line. Trend line. The fourth one is going to be in PCP. PCP in the potential continuation pattern. 
in this situation, this is Tola Senzanjan, full situation left. If we are zone trader, this one, focus on this one. If we are zone trader, this one, focus on this one. If you know that you are trading this one, focus on this one. If you are trading this one, focus on this one. If you want to learn more about these patterns, make sure that you go to my YouTube channel because we are available. It is very much cheap right now. Right now, you can get it for as little as 200. Make sure that you get the course. You're gonna benefit a lot from that course. Sure. Now, let's say you're using trend line specific. Let's check with you in a chart, or let's say you're using one hour time frame. You chat literally the one hour time frame. This nigga is the amount of supply and demand of dollar, of which is here. First uh, pattern that we got this one. You check here which pattern do we have? We have a trend line. Again, here we have what? A trend line. Just number of trend lines out too. Now, what else are we looking for? Sifuna, a potential continuation pattern. Now, a potential continuation pattern here. Now, what? The market came back to test the potential continuation pattern. What do we have? We have a rally. Here's the base. And then here's the rally again. The market turned here to test the potential continuation pattern. How many patterns do we have? Three of them are here. Now, we are looking for what? Support and resistance. Let's look for what? Bono, which is in the Etona, this one, uh, it's not accurate. Uh, one, it's a bit accurate, but not 100% accurate, but it is. It is here where the break of structure. The market was supposed to go up and test which can be stick this green can be stick as what well, as a potential continuation pattern because if it was never tested. Instead, the market turned here based on the support. So, for you as a trader, choose one uh, pattern that you can use. Or if you follow one master wrong, so there's nothing wrong, you can do that. And then now we're gonna focus on the support and resistance. Support and resistance, can you say? It takes time over the toilet trading with support and resistance. But you you're gonna benefit a lot. Look at how the market came back down or how the market went down. The stop loss circle is gonna be here. You will also rely on your reference. If there's nothing that can cause the market to go up, Take your trade here. And then you know how many touches are we looking for before we take the trade. Coming back to the potential, the potential the supply and demand. Look at how many hours are you waiting to the end. It's one, two, three. Three hours close to where it's four kind of market here part. You're doing nothing. You're waiting for the market to come and test this supply and demand so that you can sell. Same applies to the trend line. One, two, the market took so many hours to give us the third touch so that you can sell. Same applies to this potential continuation pattern. What do I have here? I have a drop base drop. The market turned to test the drop base drop before it came How many hours? Four are here. One, two, three, four with this one. You create a lot. So you're waiting for hours before you take the trade. That's what is common with trading. You wait for the right opportunity. But the Oma Oma in the right opportunities. Therefore, you have challenges to market. We don't create opportunities that are not there. If there's no opportunity, make sure that you don't do anything in the market. You can open, we can open a new chart here. It doesn't matter. Let's take any random chart and check. We're going to use one hour. It's fine. Oh, here we go. Now, looking at this, the market is going up. Let's check on daily time frame. Look at this here in my support. We penetrate in the entry bit. It is pushing all the way up. I'm on daily time frame. Now, a potential continuation pattern. Let's say I'm focusing on this potential continuation pattern. What am I going to do right now? Nothing. I'll wait for the market to go up to this level so that I can sell. Someone may say, ah, oh, man. You're going to wait days without beginning to trade, blah, 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 blah. Come, come month end, when I can just keep playing the mind is needed. Just learn to treat the trading as a career. Once you learn to treat the trading as a career, then you start preventing unnecessary losses. But then if you use trading as a get-rich-quick scheme, then also one is focused at the end of the day. 
I'm on daily time frame. Let's say here on daily time frame, we decide to and now you want to use trend lines on daily time frame. I said to you, you can. Here is your first time. Well, my case at ease. Here is your second time. This is where you're supposed to sell. So if you had a chance to sell here, look at how the market went down. But then if you're still facing AMA challenges on which you don't know what to do in the market, I will advise you to go and visit my course right now. It costs the available. It costs only 200 right now. The normal price of the course is 1,000. Make sure that you grab the course right now. Over to Funda is Funda. You trade in an echo with new master, you need a skill. Right, pinna and the money. To know you trading, you must have a skill. Umu and also is skill caution because you won't understand the way to sell, you won't know where not to sell. What you do, you keep on creating um, opportunities that are not good. Now, let me break it down for you. Yeah, they left us a what a potential continuation pattern on daily time frame. This is the reason why I love higher time frame. You can see scala with 50 minutes, you go higher time frame. I don't use about 15 minutes. I'm saying money, I'll say in terms of 50. But then I don't love smaller time frames. Now a higher time frame. You will wait for hours. You can see here we want daily time frame now. Yeah? For you after um, after a day, you see one can speak for the whole day, one can speak here. So here it took us three days to see the end. You highlight the whole potential continuation pattern. Your stop loss is gonna be above. Oh my what did we use to sell here? This potential continuation pattern. The market went down. If we are the tester with this red candlestick, with this green candlestick, that's where we get in. We don't just get in anywhere. Now, feel an article now like the right place to get in. I market you feel it as you can see the market went down. Oh my, if you are like a potential continuation pattern, what do you do in job you create? And you don't do anything. We on daily time frame, as you can see. You don't do anything. Wait for the market to come back and test this potential continuation pattern. You get in, you sell. The results are gonna be wonderful. Now look at this. These are the things that you guys need to understand. Your stop loss is gonna be above like this. Give the space and give the market a space to break. You bring back down the arrow lock as your stop loss again. Give the market a space to break. Now, Ilos Yap is very small compared to profit Yap. Same applies here. The market look here, Pantagan, but my creator is potential continuation pattern. Give me a kind of figure. I know how to trade a potential continuation pattern. Therefore, I know which we still go into that particular direction. It's a downtrend. I add more orders here to sell. Remember, from here to here on daily time frame, it's a lot of money. Only if you understand. But only if you are still scared of the higher time frame, uh, that's where you also buy the challenge is gone. Now you can see the market is going up. Why did the market turn here specifically? The answer is on your left hand side. You have a new potential continuation pattern that was never tested. Hence, I said, you wait for the right time to sell. Look at this. Look at this. What were you doing in the meantime? Nothing new. You know very well that the market is supposed to come back to this level. This is where you're going to place your take profit. You're going to sell here. Your take profit is going to be on your left hand side. Guys, if you do have a much challenges, you are watching this video on YouTube. Make sure that you leave your comments so that I can help you in the video as well as with Caesar according to the problem of the sign and the trading. The trading is not hard. Into a hard end of it is even a band of a tata amalos is that are very hard. Sinabanto abafunu barich immediately abantu abawas in the zela in the market. Look at this. For market, you don't have to, to create ama opportunities that are not good. If there's no opportunity, feel free, don't do much. Puma is a way when there's an opportunity. Um, I'm using a daily time frame here. Look at this. Which is what I only use four patterns in the market. I have a pattern like this one, I'm not working. It's fine. Meaning, I put Yonke and this thing, I'm using it and it is working for me. Now, 
if Kuguti on daily time frame, you can have a trend line, like, a trend line that looks like this one, it needs a matter of that. Why not trade a trend line if you are profitable? Well, the market gave us the support here. We had a chance to sell you. We will come up on your support based on the left hand side. Now, as the market was going down, I'm on daily time frame. A potential continuation pattern was created. Yeah. What does that mean to me? We are still going to that particular direction, of which is a downtrend. Therefore, I'll wait for the market to come back and test this level so I can add more orders. Now, look at what happened. For two days, the market was going up. For full two days, the market was going up. What were, what were you doing in that? Nothing other than waiting for the market to give you the third the, the, the other than waiting for the market to test the potential contingency pattern. You can see it was tested and then the market continued with the direction. Now, why did the market turn here? We have a new support on the left hand side. It was never tested as it was tested here. This is where you're supposed to buy. After buying here, look at the results. You trade potential continuation pattern only in the market, you look for another one. You see, there will be a time when you get potential continuation pattern that are not going to work. Uh, that, those are the 10% of the market where the market's going to be against you. But always remember, take a potential continuation pattern for how many other direction in the market. You cannot just say, ah, yes, I see there's a potential continuation pattern, I'm going to take it. Mm -mm. Always analyze and understand the higher time frame which it's in you. For my higher time frame, ignorance and ignorance of Jehuti, we are selling. Look for some opportunities. For my ignorance and ignorance of Jehuti, we are buying. Look for buy opportunities. Don't create opportunities that are not there. That is why people will have so many challenges. They want to create things that are not there. I'm full of my usual mentality. Let us always observe it. I'm an opportunity that, uh, we claim to, to see a corner of value and then another. Because Uma, whatever that you claim to see is not there, therefore you're going to have problems. Imagine creating a big opportunity and you go here looking at this claim, this big, you'll be like, ah, you know what? Here you have a support line. I'm sorry, here you have a resistance. You can see, you can see on my left hand side, now it's the right place to sell for us. Here you start selling here, then this is what you're going to see now. About who trading our full woman is never instead of looking born about a market and they want to kill the market, guys. The right way to trade, you don't kill the market, you wait for the right opportunity and then you take the trade. That is why someday you feel like, no, you may see pretty about jelly or another trade. Me, that is why I want to have a profitable bubble, profitable bubble, or special to move up the channel. You fail to take the instruction. If Utata instruction is given, or tell you don't do this, do this and this and this and this. When I'm out there trading once or what are you going to see? What are you expecting? I'm on daily time frame. This one, as a check which I create Kangarana using a trend lines. If no one's island you correspond to that, combo which you wait for the right opportunity. Here's your first time. Here's your second time. The market determined you and I and you. Look at the candlestick while the market was going up. Why is that? We have uh, more traders who are buying here. Why specifically? We have traders who are trading support and resistance. We have traders who are trading trend lines. If you want to learn more about uh, how to find trades, trades like that, visit my website. My website is www.forexbinchasers.com. We check the in the coupon which will expire. You can expire or something so that you can learn. If you look for this one, you may. That's going to be 1.5. Thank you. Now, let's continue. I know some of you will be like, ah, man, I cannot trade on a higher time frame like this because the higher time frame of an unknown, uh, hey, my news will lose uh, a, a lot of money. It's easy in the market and in which it is in the coin, very fine. And then try to use the higher time frame. You will see in which you oh, create Kangalan. Bugala, in the beginning of a new trend, you're going to get a supply and demand. Oma Utona is supply and demand in the beginning of a new trend. What do you do? You wait for the market to come back and test it and then you take it. Now, for two days, the market was going down. How much are you going to make from this trade? How much day you time frame? Just check before hour. Don't just keep lying. Not sure which you are carrying. 
the software here if you had a chance to get in here where were you gonna exit now you have to rely on this uptrend to take the exit here sharp let's start by observing what we have here yeah, well, oh, here you have the, 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 the trend line as well. Trend line here between which we are going on. We have a new supply and demand here. The supply and demand here for between which now we are changing the direction. You missed your entry to get in here. The market went up. It came back down to test in the supply and demand. This is where you want to get in. You use this one on a higher time frame or solar in the supply and demand. But we have a smaller time frame or solar in again here. The supply and demand. The more money supply and demand, what you do, you buy. Sharp line, if I yield a new one. Now, each of these are in specific here. Remember, the market has a sunny touch of this unit. Okay, I'm not saying a china margin. I feel like hey, I have to change the direction. No. Whatever that you see here, I always say whenever the market is going up, use your downtrend. Whenever the market is going down, use your uptrend. Look at this on my left hand side. What do I have here? Potential continuation pattern. That caused the market to turn off. Check on six hours. There's nothing on six hours. Check on eight. There's nothing again on eight hours. Why did the market turn off? You go to four hours to understand almost everything. Or oh, let's go to three hour time frame. On three hour time frame, you adjust everything. You put it like this. Here is your potential continuation pattern. It was never tested. The market turned off. You look at what we have here. We have a drop base drop. The market went up to test the drop base drop. What do you do? You get in the sell. There is the place where, or oh, see, there's a right place for you to get in. I always say that there's a right place to get in. You don't just get in anywhere. Just because of you feel like, I know it. The market's gonna change the direction here, so now I'm gonna I'm gonna get in. The laws of one is proper for like if you're gonna do that. So make it your priority in which you learn how to trade. Once you master the skill, no one's gonna take the skill away from you. You know very well that okay, here yeah, they left me a potential continuation present. There's nothing that I'm gonna do up until the market returns to this level so that I can do what I can buy. Now look at the size of the candlestick here. After it tested the potential continuation pattern, look at this green candlestick that put all the way up. What is the message here to us? We have more buyers. Why? Because of this candlestick. Why do we have this kind of candlestick? The candlestick may a lama buyers, actually a lama sellers. What do I mean by that? We add the more people that are pushing to that particular direction. Remember, in market melee, even a money ending at we are buying. If we have 5 million at the market is going up, if we have 2 million at now, we are going down. Eventually, have 5 million, they will push the market up. Then, when I get 500, I will be direction. I will be direction. I will be direction. Because we have the money on the market, if we are going to change the direction of the market. Specifically, I'm on three hours. You are trading trend lines, no? First time, second time. What do you do in time? You don't do anything. You wait for the market to give you the dead touch so that you can sell. After getting the dead touch, that's where you're gonna sell. Now, I want you to look at this. Look at the size of the candlesticks here, this size, blah, 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 blah. They're very much small up until here. Why do we have a candlestick? Uh, why, why did the market change from here? Young people, they will always give you. Here you have a rally base rally. Why is a rally base rally? You look at it here. Go to the line chart of you see. This is where it is. It is not in the beginning of the trend. It is somewhere far from the beginning. Sharp go back to our candlestick line. So the market pushed all the way up. It came back to test this one. A monetary hour time frame, you can see how many hours? Three, six, nine, twelve. For twelve hours, you're waiting to sell them to buy them. You don't go around and create opportunities that are not there. Wait for the right opportunity. If you want to learn how to trade using my style, make sure that you go to my website. You'll get a course. The course is available, it is very much cheap. 
all of the things that I use in the market, they are profitable. Check, you buy here, you place your stop loss below, look at how it went up. Now, how or where do you know that this is the right place to exit? Use your left hand side. First time, second time, you're supposed to sell here. We are small students, I'm listening to Dr. Sawyer classes. This is where you're going to sell. You place your stop loss above that in market behavior. For long run or higher time frame, you notice that the market is a competition. It's a sell. You don't do much, you just wait, look for some opportunities. But maybe another one. Now it's an opportunity. What do you do? You sell. Now it's in Lanyako. It's in Lanyako. It's first time, second time, they went down. They came back to test. You can see. But continue on a downtrend. You go to four hour time frame, you go to four hour time but go for our time frame and some way guys compared to one hour compared to, so compared to three hours. Looking at this one, it is still accurate. Go back to three hours, this one is hundred percent accurate. You sell. Now I want to sell a range. Boom, 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 make sure as as you sell the trend line here. Look at the size of the candlestick. Look at the size of the candlestick after the third time touch. Look at the size of the candlestick. There's no green candlestick. Look at the third time, there's no green candlestick up until here. Look at what happened, green and red candlestick at the same time. After the third touch here, green candlestick spawn. Why people are keep on saying, hey, people must not use trend lines. Hey, hey, hey. if you use trend lines, you're not going to be profitable back then. I'm showing you something here. Okay, fine, no problem. Already, if you are my student, you know how to use support and resistance. Once a resistance broken so that you support, this is where you're supposed to carry it. Getting here from land in the market for up. Whatever that happened on the left hand side, you control what's going to happen on the right hand side. Here, this is what you have. Let's highlight that candlestick. Let's move to the right. That is why I said if the market is going up, rely on the downtrend. Now look at this. The left to this candlestick. They came to this candlestick, the stock prices above, the market came back down. Let's check what happened here. I'm not sure how accurate it is. Well, hope you guys can see first time, second time, this is where you're supposed to buy. Okay, shut. They are going up now. But the guys, I hope you guys can see the then I mean, I think I said, <coughs> hope you guys can see the then If you want to learn more about this, Make sure that you go to my YouTube channel. Make sure, I'm sorry, make sure that you go to my website, you create the course. The website is www.forexinjesus.com. Make sure that you go to my YouTube channel and create the course for the land. Now, I always say whenever you are using a support and resistance, Uma also say, Tola in a touches are more than two, don't take it. How many touches do you have on the support? I'm on, I'm on three hours. One, Two, it was broken. You go to two hour, you might get a potential continuation pattern. Let me highlight it. I'll show you. Someone will be like, how do you know that? How do you know that there's a potential continuation pattern in the experience? Experience, let's go to two hour and look at that level. Here is a potential continuation pattern I highlighted. Experience in the market. The more experience you have, the more you understand what is happening. Your king is about to be born. Again, only if Uzo Funitata steps over to an hour of Funa. Oma Oma Funi Ufunda, Ufunitata Ama decision in the propellers, then you will not learn to go to the Tarana. It's still about to go by legging the Uzo to Usbam, the Tusas, Ubena, so that it will be easy for you to take the decision. You go to one hour time frame. You check the uncle and take at the Sibuga or the Tona. If you want to trade for one hour, still in the corner, you wait for the right opportunity. Bugala. What we have, even during 19 Tanga, accurate, we have the supply and demand in the beginning of the new trend. They came back down to the supply and demand before by the buy attention. Why in a specific? If we serve a supply and demand, I don't know which was saying inside. But as trading is supply and demand all the way, so many patterns that you guys can use. I'm a break of structural support and resistance, a corner you can master them. They're gonna pay you a lot. 
there's a lot that you can use in the market. But believe me, as much as there's a lot that you can trade in the market, everything is common. What do I mean by that? Um, all the pattern that you need, you have to wait for them. All the pattern that you use, you wait for you to have a test that before you buy, before you sell. You don't look at this and be like, ah, I can see I have a sense of green candlestick that means it's a buy. Imagine buying here, the market came back down. Come on, one hour. You have sharp. By the time you try, you rely on this can be ah, oh, ah, flip, ah, flip. No, it's a sell. It's a sell. You think at the moment time, yeah, you start selling, you change the direction you have to Guys, mentally explain a lot of corner. This is very simple. Like, you change the direction. You be like, ah, young man, I'm like, ah, you mean you get this? You change the direction. You shall stop the circle. Looking at this candlestick, you swear that no, it's a sell, man. Flip. Hey, momentum, yeah, it's very much strong. I have to sell. You start selling here. Yeah. You place your stop loss cut out. Yes, now you become excited, you smile, you screenshot, you show people the next thing, you yeah, kick her out. We are again, we are buy up to kick it out here. Yeah. These guys, they know how you guys think. They will play with you. They will play with you. Believe me when I say so, they will play with you. They know what you guys don't have experience. So if you do have experience here, yeah, you don't do much. If you realize that the market's in an uptrend, you look for buy opportunities. That's it. But then you, because you don't have experience, you want to find yourself buying. You want to find yourself selling. You want to eat almost everywhere, everywhere. You relax. About, oh, okay, they left you this, they'll come back home. You can do your buy. Oh, they left you three candy stick here, they'll come back to test the trend line. I'm saying, I'll go here. Nah, just relax. First time, second time, this is where you're going to buy. Try move you that way. What I'm saying to you guys here, which you must start at the skill of not taking trades when there's no opportunity. Someone's told you, oh, want to create some opportunities that are not good. Once you start doing that, believe me, you, you spoke all those bonus pillars, hambangenia, or season of your life. I believe no one uh, is ready for that. Mm, guys, if it is your first time watching my YouTube video, make sure that you subscribe. Make sure that you follow me on the social media platforms. Um, and again, go and take the course on the website. Because it is very much cheap. You're going to get it for as little as 200 But that's not the normal price. As soon as you see the video, that's the best way you can get the, the course. Because for as cheap as 200 Make sure that you visit my website. My website is www.forexpenjesus.com. I'm a lesson to army directly, they cost one per time. So it will be your choice whether you go to um, YouTube, I'm sorry, whether you go to the website or you, go, you come to me directly. Water. Here is your first time, second time, this is where you're supposed to sell. You sell here, I'm a result now, I'm a shop. You trade your potential continuation pattern, yes, sir. You will never do it. I'm seven Zako here, I'm not never fit. I'll see you. Seven Zako, you really like You just wait for the right opportunity. You, excuse me, you buy. You wait for the right opportunity yourself. Want to master a little part, like you are done. Someone once asked me to why I'm asking you to sell my candy stick pattern. What's the cost? They, they told me they must be men among my candy stick pattern. Personally, I don't use them. And that's my uh, personal reason. When, if you want to use a market stick pattern, you can use them to have to among other seven days fun analysis. Or I was one and just fun analysis for one move. And those two hours are then the ends when you don't realize the market stick pattern. Imagine waiting for the engulfing candy stick. After it's only engulfing candy stick, you start, you start buying. You place a stop loss roughly here. You have a shy stop loss up to the right direction. That's which is wrong. But there's nothing that I'm going to say about that. I want to back in the valley and the valley. So, guys, make sure you go to the. What they call this thing? You go to the website, your phone, that will land over there. 